So we know from observations that ice shelves around Antarctica have changed their thicknesses. Um, in most parts they have thinned, there are some areas where they have thickened, but we know they have changed. We know this because we have satellite data and we have about 25 years of these observations. We also know that the ice upstream of the boundary line has changed its velocity. Uh, in most parts the ice has sped up a bit, some other regions have slowed down. Now the question is, are these two observations somehow connected? Is it possible that the thinning of the ice shelves, or the changes in the thicknesses of the ice shelves, are actually causing the changes we see in ice flow upstream of the ground line? So this is the question we were looking at. Uh, we did this by plugging into our numerical ice flow model the observed changes in ice shelf thicknesses, and then we then calculated the response of the ice upstream. Now our conclusion is that the pattern of response is so similar to the observed pattern in ice flow changes that is very likely that the thinning of ice shelves is the actual physical mechanism causing the changes in ice flow upstream of the ground line. In this study, we looked at the instantaneous response and we found that there's a significant instantaneous response of the ice upstream of the ground line to the changes happening downstream of the ground line. 